Like people, let me let, let me let me let you see something. This false prophet made a video. I uh, we took the word of God and condemned his doctrine. He said Jesus Christ is not the Son of God. And we gave scripture, and I want you to see and hear for yourself. Now his pay private. He ain't public. He will not come on my page. He's doing all this on his page. But I want him to come public. But I want you to hear. I want you to hear. He going to say the scripture. That. We gave. And he's going to lie on the scripture. He's going to say the re He's going to say that God gave the scripture. To confuse us. Where have God been confusing folks? He going to say. He gonna, he going to actually say that. Listen. All right, all right, folks. This is all True 64 coming in. Listen, again. listen. And um, <clears throat> this video is for Robert Dumlap. Yeah, you know what? Dumlap. Yeah, because he's dumb. You know, the man, uh, you know, he don't know what he's talking about. You know, he, he sits on YouTube and make a lot of videos. But, you know, he, he don't open up nothing. He don't explain nothing. And he won't come and repent for the lie that he told on Philip. All right, Robert, here's my advice. Maybe you're hard to understand it, or maybe you don't understand, all right? And if that's the case, here's what I'm trying to tell you. Now, you need to repent for preaching that lie about Philip the evangelist, saying that he had seven daughters, all right? Acts 21 9 condemns that. And it says he had four daughters. Did you get that, Robert Dunlap? Alright? You must have got it because you made a comment on the video saying yeah. that, oh yeah, uh, uh, my mistake, you was correct. No, 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 no. Robert Dunlap, I wasn't correct. Acts 21 9 was correct. Don't put me in it. I just showed you where. The stretcher said that he had four daughters. So you lied on the stretcher, not me. So don't come telling me you made a mistake. Go tell the public because you preached that to the public. That's what I'm trying to tell you. Don't make comments down there to me where the public can't see it. You want the public to see your videos? Go back and tell them that you lied on Philip the Evangelist by saying he had seven daughters. Go back and do that. Make a video. Since you're making all these videos, make a video stating that you lie, that Philip the Evangelist has seven daughters, and you want to correct that mistake, and say, according to Acts 21.9, it says he only had four. Then Mr. Dunlap, once you get that done to the public, go somewhere and sit down, because nobody wants to hear you. You're lying. Because if you lied about that, what else is you lying about? Oh, that's right. You lied and said that there was a son of God in heaven now sitting on the right hand of the Father. Listen, people, listen. You're, the, you're not the only one that believed that lie. Listen, There's people. There's a whole lot of you out there that believes that lie. You son of God now, folks. Well, here's my question again. Here's another one. If the son of God is sitting on the right hand of the Father right now, all right, while he's sitting on the right hand, tell me what do he do? Consist of what do the Son of God consist of right now since he's on the right hand of the Father? Flesh and blood. Then you got to give me the Bible that flesh and blood can, uh, can uh, enter into the kingdom of God. Flesh and bones. Then you got to give me a Bible that Mary, or give me a Bible that uh, the Son of God couldn't redeem us back with blood if he was flesh and bone. With nothing in it, just flesh and bone. Then you got to give me a Bible if you say he's spirit. You got to give me a Bible where Mary birthed the spirit. So either way you go, Mr. Dunlap, you're done. Not only you, everybody else. That's the question I'm going to ask all of you. I don't care where you go. You you ran to Hebrews uh, uh, 4.14. For we have a great high priest that passed in the heaven. Jesus, the Son of God. See, that scripture confused you. That's a mystery there. They didn't say the Son of God passed in the heaven. They said the great high priest passed in the heaven. Well, if you want to say that was the Son of God, 
He just told a lie on the Bible. The Bible did say Jesus, the Son of God, passed into heaven. He just told a lie on the scripture. Now, let me, let me look how he tried to address that and say God put that scripture to confuse us. Listen now, listen. Then I'm going to ask you again. Tell me, what did that high priest consist of that passed in heaven? Flesh and blood, flesh and bone, or spirit? You got to give me something because like, they saw him. So tell me something, and whatever your answer is, give me Bible to back it up. Because I said that great high priest that passed into heaven was God himself. Because that great high priest was after the order of Melchizedek. And then I want you to tell me what was Melchizedek's order. Because that was God that passed into heaven. Yeah, you say, oh, what about the, uh, it says Jesus, the Son of God? He threw a title on there to confuse you. You see, you hear that? He confused God, confused you. But you know what? He only revealed this to his servants. The church know what that means. The church is not confused. They know what went up. They know a great high priest went up. They okay. know the Son of God didn't go up. They know the Son of God consistent. Let me. You see that? You see how he lies on the scripture? That's enough. 